welcome back to my channel and I'm sorry it's been a while since I've posted a video. Today I'm going to be doing a review of the Heat Pulse Knee Massager from Hydragun. I've been seeing this on Instagram a lot and apparently you can use it on your knees and also on your shoulders but let's do a review and, and see what it actually does. So this is made with 360 degrees lightweight silkro. The heat pulse allows for a snug, customized fit on any knee. Enjoy up to one hour of soothing heated massage for a lasting, fuss-free and effective recovery experience. So this is the package that it comes in. That's just the slip with the information. The box then just opens up on the side. It's just a magnetic flap and you can't really see much. So I think this is the control. It's magnetic behind and the controls are here. The material is nice and comfortable. Um, it looks pretty good quality. There's a Velcro strap that isn't cheap quality. Very easy to use. Then the inside is this mesh material. There's like a lump here and a lump there. And I don't know why there's a pocket in there, but we'll have a read of the manual and see. This is the charger. I should have probably charged this before I started doing this. Let's hope that it has some battery first. And then this is another strap, which I don't know what this is for, but yeah graphene band with dual vibrating cores that's what those lumps were this m button is to control the massage okay i think i know what to do i'm gonna put this on my right knee it's the less important knee <laughs> so i can just strap it here i'm gonna show you what that looks like it's a little bit loose so i might just tighten it a bit which is probably easier to do while standing up. So let's put that there. And there. It goes right here where the buttons match up. So this will just go onto there like that. Let's put it on. That was easy. Okay. So to turn it on, I just press the button on the bottom, which looks like an on off button here. The plus and minus are to adjust the heat settings. And right now it's at 40 degrees. I'm just going to make it a little bit lower. Or maybe that's the lowest. Let's try to go higher. Yep, 40 degrees is the lowest. It goes up in five degree increments. I'm going to keep it on the lowest first. Right now it's on 40 degrees heat and I can actually feel it heating up. It's quite a pleasant experience, I think, because it just feels a little bit warm, but it's not too hot or going to burn you. So now I'm just going to try and turn on the massager. Ooh. Ooh. So there's just bits of vibration happening in very short intervals. Okay, so I've got it on the highest speed, which is speed three. And you can tell what speed it is by the color of the light behind the M. That was honestly so easy. I'm just gonna take this off and try it on my shoulder now. So this goes on the outside. That goes here. I would recommend strapping it together first and then putting it on your shoulder. And then this one just wraps around here. And there we go. Okay. I look like Wonder Woman to speed two. So I think maybe it has to warm up first before the massager turns on. So I'm just gonna sit here and enjoy the massage. It's nice. I like it. So pros and cons about this knee massager slash shoulder massager. Pros, I love how easy it is to strap on and to use. It's literally just attachable and detachable. Um, it's really comfortable, but it also seems to fit 
different shapes and sizes so if you're a little bit bigger than me or a little bit smaller than me it's very adjustable the feeling is nice and overall it's a really good buy i can see myself using this before training after training it's really useful the only thing i would criticize about this is maybe the touch screen is potentially easy to accidentally turn on if you're leaving it in your bag or something maybe it'll turn on by itself i think that's an overstatement this is like a personal preference thing but the only other thing i would criticize about this is that i would prefer it in an all black but <laughs> it's already a dark plain color and this color isn't ugly so that's literally just very subjective and a small thing that doesn't really need to change so yeah that's my review of the heat pulse knee massager so this product costs 199 dollars australian and you can find the link to purchase it in my description but i actually do also have an ongoing discount with them so you can find the discount code below in the description and i hope you guys got the information that you need especially if you're an athlete or if you have a knee injury or a shoulder injury i would definitely recommend this product and i'm not just saying that because i'm actually using it right now and i'm convinced that after using this i would actually buy this it is a little pricey but that's kind of how it goes with quality products you do have to pay a little bit more most importantly it's useful so thanks for watching and stay tuned for more i am going to be continuing to do more vlogs this year I'll see you guys next time. Bye.